today's video is going to be a tips on how to start a YouTube channel. How to start a YouTube channel. What you need to know about starting a YouTube channel. You always wanted to do it, but you don't know when the correct time to do it, but you really want to do it. Okay. Alright, so starting a YouTube channel. You need to know your topic. You need to know the categories that you're going to be in. You need to, basically topic. And you know what your niche is. Niche. You need to know what your niche is. Your niche is going to basically be about whatever you're going to talk about. But you need to stay with it. You don't need to talk about hair. But then next week you're talking about nails. A lot of people might not want to see anything about nails. A lot of people might not want to see, you know, nails. They want to just, you know, stick with the hair. If you want to be that person that they want to see you know that person that they love you know going to oh my god I know who I can go to if I want to be on fleet this weekend yes I put up this person here boom I can go to that person boom oh she uploaded a video there you go see you want to be that type of individual to catch people's eyes like with makeup I have wanted to do everything on this channel but I'm like a lot of people are not really feeling it a lot of people are not really feeling the fact that I'm doing a planner video when this video is about beauty this channel is about beauty, okay? So that's why I come, came up with Beauty Planner Designs. Yeah, I'm the same person, but you're not going to see my face as much on here because you're just going to see your planner. And that planner channel is basically Beauty Planner Designs. Basically, if you're going to start your channel, you need to be consistent with your topic. Being consistent with your topic and also not being, also not going to. Dominican Republic, but you're stuck in, say, Dallas, Texas. You don't want to go that far out. You don't want to be like, oh, you lost me. You want to stay right in Dallas, Texas. Talk to the people in Dallas, Texas. Continue to catch their their attention and be like, oh, well, since I got your attention, this is what I got you going with. You know, I done had you for a while. Then we're going to go on this little nice little vacation to the Dominican Republic. But when you go to the Dominican Republic, you're going to still talk like you're back in Dallas, Texas. See, it's, it's best basically about growth and development. Um, writing down what videos you want to do. I have a planner. It's not a planner, it's a notebook, but I made it to a planner and it's not my favorite color. What's that? What that say? YouTube. I decorated and I put YouTube on it. YouTube is what I like. YouTube is what I like to have. YouTube is what I love. So I put YouTube on it. It grabs my attention more. Even though blue, blue is not my favorite color, but it grabs my attention more. So YouTube. Basically, I use this planner. Write down my schedule. If I am struggling with something, oh, I can go to my planner. I wrote it down. I wrote it down. I got everything. I go to my planner with it. You know, <laughs> I sp spread everything out. This is your me time. You're going to get ready, get comfortable, you know, get in your bed and uh, or whatever, you know, that's great for you. Get on your tablet, laptop, whatever, and plan out your video. It takes time. Plan out your video if you do not want to use a notebook, you can use your computer, or if you want to use your computer, use something that's going to do well with, you know, editing. And then, hey, everything comes to mind, and then when you're ready to film, it, was, it won't be as hard to do. And then you're all relieved, you're ready to go, thumbs up, and get to going. I do plan with me, boom, post it on that channel. Uh, had a certain amount of day, certain have it where I uh, record a certain day or two on that channel. You know, boom, come to my vlog channel. I have it's the Honest Life TV TV vlogs. You know, doom, 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 doom. then I come to this channel, Beauty by Diana D. Focus everything that's on Beauty by Diana D. But I have it all in a planta and red because YouTube red, so I have them in ink. Okay. Um. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I wrote down my videos. I have written down 37 videos. They're, these are all upcoming videos. I've written them down. I wrote it out. As video title, topic, needs, and then I wrote down miscellaneous. You know, I just wrote everything down thanks to Tracy Timberlake. <laughs> um, she is very good. If you need help, go to her. Okay. Um, I, wrote, I wrote it down. Everything I wrote, I gave me like a little planner, you know. <laughs> I mean, I wrote everything down, and it helps. 
you know, it's easy to do that. If you're the right person to have time of the day, you know, be like, this is your me time. You know, YouTube is your me time to plan out. Because if you don't have your me time for your videos, people are going to tell. You're not going to be able to grasp people's attention if they don't see that you're working hard on your videos. You can't just sit here and go home and put on a, you know, just do a video. It, it's, it's like you have to process, process the video that you're going to do. Process it, think about it, meditate on it. You know, let your ideas come to mind, let it flow. Boom, there you go. All right, editing, editing. I before I uh, really got into YouTube seriously, I really used um, it was Windows Media, Windows Live Media Movie Maker. Windows Live Movie Maker is good. It's it's a good website if you have like an HP, but if you have an iMac or you can use Final Cut Pro, and you can also can use iMovie. I use iMovie. My next upgrade is going to be Final Cut Pro. But currently I use iMovie because I like iMovie because you got a lot of cool stuff that you can use. Editing is very important. It's very important, but don't over edit. Please do not over edit. If you over edit, it's going to look too script. It's going to look too script. You want to be you. You want to be the, you want to be you just like Jersey tells me all the time, be the best possible version of you. Hey Jersey. So you want to be you. You want to be yourself. You don't want to be like, yeah, you want to go to her goal. Like say if I use Alicia Marie for an example. Okay, I want to be like Alicia Marie. You don't want to be like nobody but yourself. Okay, because people can tell. I did, um, a, what, years ago, I did, uh, when the BH Cosmetics Hollywood palette came out, I said, hey guys, y'all know who do hey guys, 11 Gorgeous, you want to come up with your own slogan, own saying, you want to do everything, okay? Um, another thing, never have your phone going off, I've learned that a lot recently, never have your phone go off, my phone is cut off every time I do a video, okay? Hashtags. You want to do hashtags. You want to get the craziest, catchiest hashtags for people to find you. Say if someone um, go online and be like, I need to look up for, look up something on YouTube real quick. Uh, if you're gonna do a video about, let's use beauty, okay? <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna use beauty community, okay? You yourself, okay? This is what I would use. I would use. Women of color beauty blogger, blogger, yeah, vlogger and blogger because I'm both. Women of color beauty vlogger, um, how to style, uh, how to, let's see, how to style beauty blogger, um, makeup routine, foundation routine, full coverage routine, eyeshadow routine, highlighting routine, blue eyeshadow, green eyeshadow. Drugstore makeup, let's say summer routine, makeup routines, anything catchy and known on YouTube, you put your hashtag. Your hashtag space should be about up to here. About that much. Not this much. Not that much. Not that much. That much. Because it's going to be easy for people to find you. Um, What's your title? Come up with the most crazy title that you can think of that's how you get your views <laughs> I know it bothers me whenever I look at oh I just won a million dollars but that video was not about no million dollars that kind of cra get crazy but sometimes people go all over the world just for a video and that's how you want it you want to go all over the world but make sure you keep your niche the same okay um, another thing I want to talk to you guys about is setup setup YouTube setup okay you need your tripod you need lights and you need um, a vanity you need a vanity I'm gonna show you guys mine okay all right here's hey y'all here's my lights there's these two lights are from uh, Amazon they're the new year ring lights they're the new year lights these are desktop lights I have me a mirror from Zadro. I got it from Bed Bath & Beyond. Very priced. Well, no. Very affordable. 
it's basically like $80 or so. And then these two lights as well. You need natural daylight because it really works and it really works very well. Very, very good. So those are my lights, okay? And then what I have standing right here is a tripod. I'm going to show you guys my tripod. So here is my tripod. Okay. You need a great tripod to keep everything. And then this is what it looks like with my lights on. And I have my lamp in the closet, you know. And then I have my light on in there. And I have my room light on. Because you're going to need good. You're going to need good lighting because you can't make a video like you could eight years ago or six years ago with just a webcam and post it online. You gotta have good lighting. Okay, I think that's pretty much all that I have for you guys. If you guys want a part two, let me know in the comments below. But I gotta go. And thank you guys so, so much for watching. Don't forget to check out all of my social media. Everything will be listed down below. And yeah, I gotta go. And I will talk to you guys soon. Bye. Hey guys, today's here. I'm gonna be doing a reacting to my old Facebook profile pics. I did my